So as a freelancer, YouTuber, or content creator, chances are at some point you're going to come across something called a PDF. And if you don't know what that is, you probably live under a rock. And as a content creator myself, this is a file type that I deal with on almost a day-to-day -day basis. And the most annoying thing about all of the PDF softwares out there is that they don't allow you to make those editing changes, easily add comments, individually adjust components, and it just becomes a complete hassle to send a PDF over the way I want it to be. But that changes when you PDF actually reached out to me and asked if I wanted to make a video on their software. I don't want to spoil anything right now, but pretty much we're going to be checking out the software. I'm going to be walking you guys through the different features, how you can use it. And yeah, that's pretty much that. But if you guys do enjoy, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Massive shout out to the people over at UPDF for making this video possible. And yeah, let's get right into it. All right, guys. So just starting out, this is the UPDF software here. You can see I'm in and I'm actually just going to full screen it just so you guys can see. But this is the main menu here. If we were to, let's say, not even have this and we just freshly installed the software, this is what it looks like. And all you got to do is literally go to open file you're gonna locate whatever file you want to open and you're gonna open it so up. this is an example of a sample statement that i have for let's say editing services and right now we are in reading mode so we're not able to actually make any changes we can just quickly look through so if we were zoomed in we can you know use our left click scroll through this but i'm zoomed out right now just so we can see now coming down here we have the comment tool this is very useful we can add a text comment wherever we'd like so imagine um we do you know um this is for editing I can't even think of a use that you'd have for like this but let's just say we added a comment to this this is for editing as if they didn't know that the marketing and editing services were weren't for editing i don't know why someone wouldn't know that but you know what i mean if you need to add a small comment you want to add the little text box you can do that now striking through is also a super cool option if we just want to get rid of something we just use the strike through uh tool right here so we just go straight through bang 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 gone so simple now my favorite thing that i love doing and this makes anything stand out is the highlight tool look how easy that was to do man like let's run that back highlight tool it's not messy. It doesn't look out of place. Like, dude, come on. Let's say also the underline tool. We can underline underline something right here. Bang. Squiggly line, same thing. Bang. What color do we want it? Blue, black, whatever. Gray, green, blue. Like, and this is just one of the many modes that they have. It's honestly insane what this can do. We're just going to get rid of that. Um, we could also add text box in here. So we could literally just add blah, blah, blah. Um, we are typing in black font in a black box so we don't really want that so we're gonna do Arial old let's say and joshy joshy blah blah and that's just an example of the text box itself that's something that's really cool we also got the text call out which allows us to call out from a specific box right here so imagine we wanted to refer to the invoice right here so we go to the call out we pick right here and we have something like that just literally indicates where we're calling out from that's pretty much that you can adjust the opacity all that pencil tool you want to draw we can easily do that you want to add like a little signature and you have messy writing like me you'd easily do something like that cool thing is we can just select a line of text exactly like this and we can strike it through manually and we can go back right here note copy text all that stuff super cool rectangle tools also a thing that i find really cool because you can just add text on top of that stickers they have like a bunch of different stuff um obviously you're able to pick between the different ones they just have like text boxes sticky notes arrows literally absolutely everything you could imagine and dude this is just like it's it's so cool the different things you can do signature also i don't have a signature yet so what we have to do is we have to right click on it go to create and i'm just going to go josh something like that create and all we got to do to add a signature <laughs> bang it's that simple we're gonna get rid of this one i don't know why i did that but dude and then you could literally just like bring it down here if you wanted to pretend to sign it or something like that dude it's just that's just one tab that we've been through so far let's let's move on to the next one so we got the edit which we are able to individually change lines of text. So let's say we wanted to change this from the 4th of July to the 5th of July, just like that. Now, if we wanted to change the year to 2024, get rid of that three, make it a four. And that's literally like that. And if we wanted to change a word, let's say we misspelled something and we wanted to make this editor agreement instead of consultants like this. So like, I, I have not seen a software that's been able to do all of this at once. It's unreal. And we're allowed to actually add images, links, text, you name it. So if we wanted to add an image, I don't even know what random image I would need, but let's say we go down to our stock footage and we add a picture of a graphics card, for example, dude, like, it's, it's unreal. The ability that we have to just like, 
mess around, add random stuff. We could resize it, bring it down here. Like, dude. Now, moving on to the prepare form, this allows us to make those final changes. Text fields, we got the check box where we can like add little check marks, all that stuff. Radio button, drop down, list box button, just all this different. It's there's just so many different things. We can organize the pages if we have multiple pages. We can rearrange them, be one after the other, split, repri replace, exact, extract. Um, just it's it's crazy what this can do now crop if we wanted a specific portion let's say we only wanted the invoice portion in here so we wanted to do a little something like this and have only this appear on the final version of our pdf literally go like that crop simple as that it's dude i don't know dude it, this is just crazy as someone who uses a pdf like software almost every single day to send statements and agreements and contracts it's unreal what the software can do it allows you to annotate edit convert ocr protect fill sign you name it just there's so many different things that the software can do all at once and it's much much cheaper than the alternative might i add this also allows you to add passwords to your file so if we wanted to we can go down here to to protect using password document open now if we wanted to do something like password the most creative password because everybody knows the most creative password is password fly and just like that we save it to wherever we want go here and let's say we were to close this and we were to boot up the software again before we go in here enter the password so we enter password unlock just like that we're in dude like this is, it's it's crazy, man, it's crazy. So from the Create tab, also might I add, it's a super cool feature. We can just literally select a Word file or an Excel file, PowerPoint, image, all that stuff. So we did PDF from image and we did something. We did something like this where we go to our stock footage, we find like a picture. We could turn a picture into a PDF. Just like, that's just a picture of Aiden Ross, so random, but you know, that's just a simple example. And literally one account on the software will be good for every single platform. So iOS, Android, Windows, Mac, you name it, literally you have access on every single platform, which is really, really cool. Even though I'm showing this on Windows, it does work super well with Mac OS 14, as well as iOS 17, iPad OS 17, and also Android. It works super well on that. One license will give you access to all platforms on four different devices. And right now it's 63% off. Unbelievable. If you guys want to save on UPDF for a limited amount of time, 63% off right now. Go check out the link at the very top of the description. That link will help you get set up on the platform itself and the link to download you pdf will also be at the top of the description for you guys to check out but dude it's unbelievable what this software could do especially if you're a content creator make the small investment pick up the software buy a license even before making this video i've used this software like 10 times for 10 different contract statements documents that i sent to clients it's just unbelievable what this software can do and i'm i genuinely can say that this is something that i have used on a day-to-day -day basis as a content creator so i think you definitely should too but if you guys did enjoy make sure to like comment subscribe massive shout out to the people over at updf for making this video possible go save 63 percent and check out the link at the top of the description see you guys later peace out